सो आर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज क्रॉस सेक्शन डायमेंशन ऑलवेज स्पेसिफाइड इन सो एज आई एक्सप्लेन यू ड्यूरिंग द एज आई एक्सप्लेन यू ड्यूरिंग द यू नो लेक्चर दैट द क्रॉस सेक्शन डायमेंशन आर लाइक लेग लेंथ और डेप्थ ऑफ द पेनिट्रेशन और द यू नो द थ्रोट थिकनेस दीज आर ऑल इंडिकेटेड और स्पेसिफाइड ऑन द लेफ्ट साइड ऑफ द वेल्ड ड्रॉइंग सो ए विल बी द आंसर Now, according to AWS 2.4, a weld symbol for the other side is placed. For other side, the weld symbol is placed above the solid line, solid reference line. Above the solid line, other side, below the solid line, uh, below the solid line, arrow side. So the answer will be C, above the solid line. Now, question number three. Weld symbols placed on the dotted line in accordance with ISO requirements means so ISO is the European standard. So weld symbol placed on the dotted line. So the weld symbol which is placed on the dotted line, uh, it means that the weld on the other side. So B will be the answer. Weld on the other side. Now weld symbol placed on a dotted line in accordance with oh this is the same question. So question number three and four are same. No problem. We'll move to the question number five. European standard for welding joints and symbol. Is nothing but EN double two double five three. So A will be the answer. Now weld length dimensions are including the following one. Weld length dimensions are including the following one. One that is the length of the weld, and it is specified by small l. So C will be the answer. In the drawing, a flag symbol indicate. So a flag symbol indicate feed or side weld. So B will be the answer. Elongated jet mentioned in the right side of the fillet welding. Drawing is see I explained you the elongated weld is nothing but the staggered fillet welding. So C will be the answer. So friends, with this we have completed the uh, you know welding symbol chapter. I hope you like this video. Thank you very much.